What's up, everybody? I'm watching the credits. Because, you know, something cool. There's a little video during the credits. So I'm going to be talking, giving my thoughts on Bioshock Infinite. Where is it? This is the version to get. Because it comes with the season pass and all DLC. Well, I did like the game. Not sure how I felt about this multiverse angle. I think they did tie the original Bioshock into this because you do visit Rapture. Spo spoiler alert, by the way. Oh, excuse me. Sorry. Just had breakfast. Um, so yeah, um, since I have the Bioshock Trilogy, I'm going to play it, and all its DLC as well, because I have the complete editions for all three games on the PS3. I do have the Bioshock collection for the PS4, which comes with all the DLC and additional stuff, but it's easier for me to record off the PS3. Uh, so I, I'll just do it on the PS3, and you know, I like the PS3 too, it was my console of choice that generation. Just as a PS4 is my console of choice this generation. So, I, I, I really like this, the whole like 1920s feel, or yeah, 1910s. Like that whole year, yeah, uh, you know. That kind of, yeah, kind of feel. So, uh, uh, this is my first Bioshock game. I, uh, you Briefly played the first one, but only like the first 10 minutes that so you really get a, a feel for the storyline, which people I've talked to about this, you know, advice like, I may not if I've ever never played a Bioshock game, which game should I play? They all said the first, and they didn't like the third. And I really like the third. I like the Skyhook mechanic. That, that shit was fun. So if I had fun with Infinite, I can't even imagine how much fun I'm going to have with the first one, since a lot of people I've talked to... Speak highly of the first one. Hardly anyone's talked about the second. Oh, they never played the second for some reason. I am, of course. <sighs> so I'm not sure if this is going to have the post credit scene. I don't know. Apparently there is. But, you know, let's see. This kind of a cappella music. What is it? Barbershop Quartet kind of music? <laughs> and this microphone even looks like something they would use from the back in that day. Like those old school, like, oh, uh, those kind of microphones. I forget what, the, what kind of microphones are called. But I like, I like it. This is impressive. Let's see the cast. Laura Bailey was in this. Jennifer Hill. Hey, that's a nice cast. Courtney Draper apparently went to law school, if I read some of the threads, the forums correctly. Deactivated all her social media accounts, and somehow someone found out she went to law school, and that's awesome. Anyway, so, yeah, I'm currently looking into action figures for this game. Because, you know, I, apart from game collecting, I do like to collect the figures and the toys. Not as much as, as, um, as my brother-in-law, but... And not as often as I would like to, because to, uh, figures are not are very expensive. Excuse me, I just had breakfast. Everyone wants to rule the world, and girls just want to have fun. Isn't that a Cindy Lauper song? Anyway, look at all these musicians. I applaud all of these musicians. Being a musician myself, 
I play bass and I dabble with guitar, but bass is my primarily my primary choice of instrument. It's the instrument I've most devoted most of my time to. This game's very musical. I really like that. I don't know if the first two games are as well. From my understanding, the second one you play a big daddy, if I'm not mistaken. I don't know, but I saw the credits beforehand. We're treated to a little, um, what you gonna call it? Um, a little music video or practice. I'm not sure who the the musicians are, but they're rehearsing, and it's pretty cool to, to watch. When that comes back on, we'll we'll watch it. I think it's a little while before that happens. Just check my phone real quick. Excuse me. Don't know. Anyway. All right. Well, all these thanks. Ian Davis. All my love to Betsy, Elijah, and Evelina. Coming home is the best part of my day. Coming home to you is the best part of my day. Uh, so many. I hope you guys are... Or if you're interested in reading these. These are people that worked on the game. Kyle Williams. For my wife and Louis Peepaws. The best reward is seeing you each night. Paul Green, love to Liza and to Boston. Sean Robertson, thanks to my lovely ladies, Nikki, Zoe, and Ava. Zoe Brooks, thank you for always supporting me, Chad and Jamie. Thank you for the push. And then more thanks. Yeah, I do. I do like the uh, attention to detail Tor towards uh, the beginning of the game when you're on a beach. Everyone's wearing those bathing suits they used to wear back in the day, like those one pieces that look very ridiculous, but fashionable. And that's cool. They, they that keen attention to detail. And a bunch of other people, whom I don't know. Scott Nelson, but my next one is probably gonna be burial, burial at sea. I hear it's a prequel to the original, and hey, I haven't played the original, so um, maybe get some Easter eggs in that one. I don't know. We'll see. Yeah, but burial at sea is gonna be my next Bioshock game. It should be fun. Nathan Wood. Is 2K still around? I don't even know. It's been a while since I've heard from them. I can this Great music, though. More credits. Qu quality assurance. I think it's coming up next. 
Here we go. It's, it's fine. It's that one line. I don't know. Let's enjoy it together. I'll figure it out. <clears throat> That's what I'm saying. Went back home, Lord. My home was lonesome. Yeah. Went back home, Lord. My home was lonesome. All my brothers. See, but then now it's too short. Now it's one too short. Because yeah, then it goes. What a home. She has a lovely voice. Went back home, Lord. My home was lonesome. All my brothers, sisters cried. What a home so sad and lonely. And then it's missing the next line. Um, that's what I'm saying, like, this is the second, that's the third, that's the fourth, but then... And I don't think that's supposed to say lonely. Probably lonely. 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 We're just missing one. We'll, we'll, we'll get the actual one. Awesome. Um, Can we run it through this video? There are loved ones in the glory Whose dear forms you often miss When you close your Earthly story Will you join them in their bliss? Will the circle be unbroken By and by, or by and by There's a better all away In the sky Do well, is make it 48 worse. I want to I want I want to take the tempo down a little bit if we can. 
um, and sort of start by finding, like, Booker, if you could just be sort of like picking away at the beginning first and then sort of start to play the song and maybe then um, you guys kind of find the tempo together a little bit. Um, I wanted to feel, you guys are so excellent and professional. Yeah, I'm, no, it won't be like that. I, okay. I want to make it sound like it's not like, you know, sure. Cheryl Crow and, and um, right. Eric Clapton <laughs> in a session. Um, so He later, gets Eric Clapton, I get Cheryl Crow. <laughs> John, who do you want, John? Right. Yeah, uh, Joplin. Uh, next, Tina. <laughs> Britney Spears okay. and Seal. Okay. Here's a post credit scene. Anna. Anna? Bioshock Infinite. Well, thank you guys so much for watching these, uh, watch taking this ride with me. But uh, the Bioshock Infinite, right? Uh, we're done with the main campaign. We're gonna do Burial Let's See and Clash in the Clouds next. So I'm excited for those. Well, we'll see you there. Thank you so much for watching. Like, subscribe, comment. I'll see you in the next video. Have a good one.